Hi guys, in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to use the InShot app to change your video background in 5 seconds. And not just that, I'm going to be showing you guys how to use other features on the InShot app for free. So, before we get started, please make sure to like, subscribe and turn on the notification bell on this channel. It doesn't cost much, it's just a way to support us. Just like and subscribe. If you can share, it's still good for us. So, like, share and subscribe so that... Once we release another informative and educating video like this one, you will be notified. Keep watching. Hi guys, welcome back once again. So guys, for me to show you how this InShot app works, first of all, you need to have this InShot app downloaded on your phone or your PC. So if you are new to InShot, just go straight to the Play Store like I'm doing now and then download type in short video maker and then you will see it i already have it in my phone so that's why it's showing update so if you have it in your phone then you are due so next thing you have to do after having this in short in your phone is go straight to the in short app And then click on video once you click on the video the next thing you are going to click on is on new so once you click on new you need to select the background yeah the picture background for the video you want to change its background so in here i'm going to be choosing an in short picture in short this in short picture is a random picture i got from the internet so that is what I'm going to be choosing. So, before I proceed, I would like to let you know that the video I'm going to be changing its background is the video that I use as intro in this particular video. So, once you've done that, and I'm going to sh I'm going to be showing you how the video was before I changed its background to ensure this in short um picture. So this is the video hi guys in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you guys how to use the InShot app to change your video background so this is how the video was before i changed it to InShot uh InShot background picture so after uh choosing the picture you want to um you want to use as your background the next thing you're going to do is to click on pip in the in short video editor click on pip so this is it so once you click on this pip it will take you straight to once you click on this pip it will take you straight to where you are going to choose the video that you are going to change its background and like i said before i'm going to be changing the background the in the background of this particular video i mean the intro I used in this particular video that's what i'm going to be changing so i'm going to click on the video so this is how the video is hi guys in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you guys so the next thing i'm going to do in this video is to click on the video to edit it as it is here now so the next thing i'm going to do is click on chroma so once i click on chroma Chroma wipes off the background of this video. So, this circle stuff now is what I'm using. Uh, it sounds like an eraser. And that's what I'm going to be using to erase this particular background in this video. Like this. So, once I erase it like this, the next thing I'm going to do is to increase the strength so that it will erase other remaining background for the so the remaining original background of the video so so this is it and that's it so as you can see now hi guys in today's video, video i'm going to be sharing with you guys how to use the InShot in app to background change. the video is having the InShot background so the next thing i'm going to do is to make the video bold so that you can be seeing me very well in the video and then place it very well hi guys in today's video 
today's video i'm going so to be sharing with you guys how to use the InShot app to change so the next thing i'm going to do is to duplicate this InShot photo so that it can contain the the whole video so this is it hi guys in today's video i'm going to be sharing now, with you guys how to use the InShot app contain, to change can contain the whole video In this intro so and that is it as simple as this so if you want to change it this is the only thing you are going to do so once you are done you can save it by clicking on save and then you are good so but I I, I won't like to save this particular video so to use other features in the in short like I promised you, I'm going to be showing you guys how to use other features in the InShot apart from the InShot background changer. So InShot, as far as I know, is one of the best smartphone app editor that I've ever used out of the app around. I think sometimes it's a, it's it comes first before KineMaster. You all know who uh, uh, the Kind Master app, but I think it's more easier and more flexible to use more than the Kind Master app. So even without using having the 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 premium version of it, you can use the the um the the free version to do most of the things. So. The next thing I'm going to be showing you guys is how to freeze, how to reverse enemy. If you may, maybe you made a mistake in the InShot uh, app editor while editing your video, you can just click here just to reverse the video. So the next thing I'm going to show you is this, which is the duplicate. If you want to duplicate any video, or rather any background picture just click on duplicate and that is it so the next thing is voice effect and this voice effect only works when you are using the complete video let's say I added this video here so I want to change the voice the only thing I'm going to do is click on the voice effect this one is Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to use the InShot app to change your video background in 5 seconds I'm not just that Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to use the InShot app to change Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to use the InShot app to change your video background Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to use the InShot Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to use the InShot. Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to use the InShot. Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you guys. Hi guys, 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 hi
rest of the video and if i don't want to duplicate it i can still make it um hi guys in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you guys how to use the InShot app to change your video background in five seconds and not just that i'm going to be sharing, showing you guys how to use other features so InShot app has so many features so many 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 features this split is when i want if i want to cut my split my video into two and then change the location i mean places i want it to be that's when i use the split so this is it so you can see this hi guys you today's video i already changed the the location from being at the back then bringing it back to the front so this one is for delete if you want to delete any of the video after everything you can just delete it like this so this is if you want to add music or an effect or if you want to also record on your own you can use the recorder i mean if you want to record a voiceover you can use the recorder if you want to add an effect you can use the as already pre-built sounds that you can use such as the bell sound and the rest and you can also do your own sound Hero is a young like woman this. who breastfed her just like this and you equally you can use a soundtrack if you want to have a soundtrack that you want to choose specifically for your video you can just add it so that is just it for the in short um app so before i forget if you want to add text to your video you can use this text editor to add any text that you want and this text you can add an effect to this text by clicking on on these two and if you want to add faint effect if you want to add zoom in effect if you want to add zoom out effect if you want to add slide effect that is how in short is you can see how it is any effect that you want to add to your to your video in short app gets you covered thanks for watching to that video please don't forget to like subscribe and equally share if you can please do that it's just a simple and a easy way to support us we are not asking you for money just support us so that our ministry will keep moving to the permanent side so thank you for watching to that video and bye for now